During the search, one English pistol with 15 rounds of 9mm ammunition was recovered from one Ibrahim Toko, who claimed to be DSS personnel. Other exhibits such as motorcycles, wraps of marijuana, illicit substance and valuables reasonable suspected to have been stolen from innocent residents were equally recovered. Pleased and have a peaceful environment. Our inter has taken us to an area in Zuba where the kidnappers used to come from their camp, both from Niger, Kaduna, they come from Tafa, from Garam Use, from Use itself, all in Niger, Kaduna, after kidnapping, they will come to Zuba to rest and enjoy. We went there, we went there for a reading and uh, you will be surprised. We have raided all these people. There are 297 men and 14 women who are involved in these nefarious activities. While suspects are still undergoing screening, the Commissioner of Police, FCT, says Operation Velvet, which was introduced to compromise all the tactical teams of the command is to curb all forms of vehicular criminalities and other crimes in the territory. The Commissioner of Police further cautioned officers against extortion of residents and to adopt professionalism in the discharge of their lawful duties as security of the populace remains its first priority. I want to use this medium to warn those people that illegally because no person gave you any license to operate, whether you call it Gidandambe or Gidandrama, you better start now because you cannot, you cannot remain in FCT. We are going to ensure we are cleansed from here. We are taking all of them to court so that they will face the law. We will operate the best practices, no matter how it is. He urges residents to report suspicious activities through the emergency phone lines. Kike Lomo Ukeri, Global Television News.